Hey guys. Welcome to our channel. Civil Engineering Guru. How are you all? Hope you all are fine. As you all know that previously we have discussed. Soil and different types of soil. So today our topic is peat soil. So move towards our today's topic. Definition. Peat is an organic complex soil, well known for its high compressibility and low stability. Peat forms naturally. By the incomplete decomposition of plant and animal constituents. Under anaerobic conditions at low temperatures. Introduction. A soil that is derived completely from the decomposing remains of plants. Plants that commonly form peat include reeds, sedges, sphagnum moss, and grasses. The plant remains do not decompose but continue to accumulate because the wet and cool environment in which they occur is not conducive to aerobic decomposition. Vegetable crops are often grown on peat soils. Peat can also be harvested for use in horticulture or as a fuel for heating and cooking. Characteristics. Peat contains. Vegetable fibers which improves water airily condition of soil. Sourness which activates the growth of plants. Elements of mineral nourishment. Such as nitrogen. Potassium. Phosphor. Calcium. Iron. Magnesium. And many other microelements. Pristine peat soils are characterized by large porosity. Low density and large water and organic matter contents. Drainage and management practices change peat properties by oxidation, compaction and mineral matter additions. This study examined differences in physical properties. Hydraulic conductivity. Water retention curve. Bulk density. Porosity. Von Post degree of decomposition and soil profiles. Of two peatland forests. A cultivated peatland. A peat extraction area and two pristine mires originally within the same peatland area. Advantages of peat. Peat moss is a highly absorbent material. It can retain water much better than other types of soils. This is a great agent to include in your garden soil. Sterile medium. Peat moss provides a sterile medium, which is ideal for planting and growing your plants. It doesn't contain any harmful chemicals. Weed seeds and other bad thing you don't want for your plants. This is why peat moss is ideal starting medium, particularly for tender, vulnerable plants that require a lot of care. This is why it's a good practice to add a bit of peat moss to any starting mix. Acidic pH features. Peat moss is slightly acidic, which means it is great for acid-loving plants. There are many plants you may wish to grow that require slightly acidic soil, such as camellias and blueberries. If your garden soil is not acidic, add a bit of peat moss to make your acid-loving plants thrive. Compaction prevention. Peat moss is not compact, which is a great advantage over other organic materials. It is important to prevent soil compaction because such soil becomes less useful. Compaction reduces water absorption and doesn't provide a good medium for any plants to grow. Peat moss is great because it can easily be rehydrated, and even one application prevents soil compaction for years. Disadvantages of peat. Despite being organic, peat moss is not really fertile. It doesn't contain nutrients plants need to grow. It has some beneficial microorganisms, but that's all. On the other hand, the nutrient content is not absolute zero, either. Peat moss does contain a bit of nutrients, minerals and beneficial microorganisms, in this sense. Peat moss will not ruin the fertility of your soil, however. You will probably need to use more than just peat moss to make your plants grow strong and healthy. Acidic pH features. As much as acidic features of peat moss can be great for some plants, these can also be a disadvantage. If you want to grow plants that are alkaline loving, if you wish to grow plants that like alkaline soil, it is better to use compost. Peat moss tends to be expensive. This is particularly true if you need large quantities of it. Think about this before opting to use peat moss. You can cut the price a bit if you don't use peat moss only. Mix it with your soil to add benefits, but avoid using large quantities of peat moss. If you guys enjoyed our today's video, then like, comment and share our today's video and subscribe our channel Civil Engineering Guru and support our channel to grow more. Thank you. Bye.